Next event is on the track. This is the under 16 girls, 1500 metres. We are drawing close. There's two more races at 1500 metres. They seem to have gone pretty quick. Um, well, coincidentally, they have gone super fast in start to finish. Um, be no gaps in between. So once these races are over, these last two races will be moving across to the 100 metre track for the time finals of the 100 metres for all age groups. So clean start for the girls here. This is the under 16s, 1500 metres event, 213. Victorian best performance of this event is 449.31, set by Sophie from Sandringham. In station one, Sarah from Chelsea, two, Susanna from Geelong, three, Kushi from Box Hill, four, Lily from Pakenham, five, Emma from Ringwood, six, Ella from Craigieburn, seven, Madison Terrelgan, eight, Rusha from Cranburn, nine, Orla from Sandringham, 10, Ella from Whittlesea City, 11, Alicia from Terrelgan, 12, Celestine from Seaford, and in 13, Taya from Ringwood. So off to a great start at the moment is Kushi from Box Hill. We did see her run the 800 metres yesterday. So we'll just get some information to hand on that. On your mark. Set. Clearly needs to be marked. So Kushi's out in front. We've got Orla sitting in second. So Kushi comes in with a seated time of 4.58. And then our, one of our athletes from Geelong, I think that might be Susanna. She comes in with a 4.58 as well from her regional time. So there are a couple of athletes. We'd probably look at Celestine from Seaford too, with a 4.57. So she's in the yellow, so currently sitting in third. So we've got Kushi out in front. We've got Orla in second and Celestine in third. Not too far behind them is Susanna from Geelong. So Kushi running out a controlled race out in front at the moment. We did see her siblings run a little bit earlier on in the piece. So some great distance running amongst this family. So second group of athletes is led by Orla at the moment. Not too far behind her is Celestine and also closing the gap is Susanna from Geelong. So do we expect those three girls to probably tussle it out for the minor medals? I don't think they'll catch Kushi unless they're going to push each other far enough forward. She really is running a strong race out in front at the moment. Just have a look and see if we can grab some of their performances from Athletics Victoria um, just to see how they fare. So Kushi did run a 4.30 so significantly quicker than her seated time for the region event. So do expect her to hold into this place and not give up that gold medal position. Not much has changed behind her at the moment. All is still sitting in second, Celestine in third, and Susanna in fourth. Big gap then to the next athlete to follow. Think that might be, I'll just see if we can go, I might have to wait for it to come back around just to make vision of the center that she's representing, but it could possibly be Alicia from Terrelgan, I think it might be, sitting there in fifth. But it is Kushi out in front. She's going to get the bell. Winding up her final lap. Comes across 325 with one lap to go. Second group, bit of a change now. All are still sitting in second, but I have seen Susanna from Geelong move up just in front of Celestine from Seaford now, who's sitting in fourth. So moving around with around about 210 metres to go. Kushi's still out in front. She's opened up that lead. Susanna from Geelong has moved into second place. She, well, she's actually holding on to that second place just in front of Orla from Sandringham and Celestine from Seaford. So do expect a strong finish from Orla based on experience she's had in distance running. Let's we'll see our Pakenham athlete pass the post for the final time. That's Lillianne from Pakenham.
And we'll just see these athletes just possibly make it past the finish post before we have Kushi come across the line, taking out this championships for 39-15 thereafter. Congratulations to her. Looks like all is going to hold off for second place, but third's going to be in contention. All might have to get a wriggle on to hold on to second. All it takes second. Third will go to Susanna, and very close after there we'll have Celestine from Seaford. Our Terrelgan athlete making her way up through the finish line. Can't quite see her hip number here. And there is the other Terrelgan athlete, I think, which has actually dropped out, is not a starter on the list. So do apologize. I can't identify. It would either be that of Alicia or Madison. Next athlete, Alla, is coming across the line from Craigieburn. Emma Taya from Ringwood. Lillian from Pakenham. Our Whittlesea City athlete coming across the line in Ella. Rusha from Cranbourne. And Emma from Ringwood. That rounds out the field for our under 16 girls, 1500 metres.